I have five kids, and they were very young kids just before we got into Sesame Street. And so I think having had young kids, you kind of tune into that area, and you sort of know what works for that area. But my own kids have always been a part of uh, the creative process, I suppose. Uh, my oldest two daughters have always been people that I bounce a lot of things off of. Uh, my oldest son is working Fraggle Rock right now. He's, he's working in with the mechanical shop. And uh, so they've always been around it and part of it. You're a very busy man. You, you travel between London, New York, uh, Los Angeles, Toronto. How do you find enough time to spend with your family to keep those home fires burning, let's say? Oh, well, it's, uh, you know, it, it is difficult. And certainly I, I uh, but I like to travel with them. I often, you know, have one or two of my kids with me at the time. And uh, uh, we enjoy family vacations, it's that sort of thing. In your book, what are the marks of a good children's television program? Oh, it's uh, quality is one of those things that it comes from talented people. You know, you get good people, you get good writers. Uh, I think the team we have on Fraggle Rock is really marvelous. And, uh, but it's, it's people that care a lot about what they're doing and, uh, and, and talent. Where do you go from here? It seems like you've just about done everything. Uh, is, is there a next step for Jim Henson? Oh, let's see. Well, we're always working on several different projects. We have a couple of things that are uh, in the works at the moment. Uh, we just finished shooting another Muppet movie. Uh, that It's called The Muppets Take Manhattan, and that opens uh, next summer. And then we've started working on our next fantasy film, which will not, uh, we won't shoot that until 85 for release in 86. So there are always a few things. You have uh, somewhat the reputation of being a perfectionist. Is that uh, an apt description of your approach to your work? No, not really. I, I, when you're working in television, you're never dealing with perfection. Uh, you know, you're always sort of, you know, you're trying very hard to get the best thing you can as fast as you can and, and keep moving along. Uh, I, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not certainly not a perfectionist, no. But you do have your standards. We, well, we, you do the best. You do, you do all that you can. <laughs>